Hey, hey, it's me, I'm back. <laughs> and I'm here with some more goodies from Charlie's Now Art. And in this resealable bag, I have this gorgeous rose pink glitter strands. Now, this stuff used to scare me <laughs> because I never knew how to use it. Excuse the state of my thumb. Um, but yeah, anyway, getting on to this gorgeous stuff. You can see that gorgeous rainbow sparkle. And what I wanted to do was show you a way I found to apply this to the nails that is so much easier. In this bag, I think you get four grams. I can't be sure, but I'll put all the links as always in the description box below. So for the purpose of this video, I have two tips. One pre-painted black and one pre-painted with a rosy pink. And I've already applied foil glue and let that dry. So now I have an old stamper that's sort of falling apart. Take no notice of the, what I'm tipping this foil on, that uh, glitter onto. I just, it's the first thing I just picked up. So before I dispersed of it in the rubbish so I'm going to open this resealable bag and tip some of the glitter strands onto there and everywhere sort of shake it to flatten them out a bit and then take the stamper with a bit of luck, the strands should stick to the stamper head. You see? And then, let's see what it looks like over a very similar base colour. Because of the foil glue, and that's why I'm saying use an old stamper, we can now just roll onto that tip and get a glitter coverage. And again, you can dunk in again, and because of the foil glue, you can just keep going and rolling over. Once you're happy with how you've got it, just use your finger to press in any odd ones. I'm just going over to make sure they're all laying flat. But you can see how quick and easy that coverage was. So now again, let's see over the black. You can see I've still got some on there, but we're going to dunk it in again. And now let's see what it looks like over the black. So you're going to get more of an effect over the darker colour than you are a similar. But you can see there, over a darker base... You can go for a full coverage strand glitter look. And that application was just so effortless, so quick and so easy. And it just looks stunning. So you can see there the two different effects over a similar colour base and a darker base. So now let's just, let's see if we can tip that into there, or well, the majority of it anyway, like so. Sadly, I don't think I'm going to be able to get any that off, so I'm just going to have to bling out my lint roller quite a few times, I should imagine. So that's why I'm saying use an old stamper. You don't want to ruin a decent one. And this one, as I said, is falling apart. But there we go. That application was quick and easy. Now to protect these and stop them from flying off, I'm looking for my top card. 
palette, which seems to have disappeared. And I've just found me glitter top coat. Well, it's not a glitter top coat, but it's a top coat that I use to apply over loose glitters. As I say, you can, it adheres to the foil really well, like the foil glue. So let's get some top coat on this. Might need a couple of layers of top coat, depending on how glossy glossy you want it and obviously if you use gel a gel top coat with a gel base would look stunning so that's over the rosy pinky base and then over the black polish base Just stunning. As I say, both of them look absolutely gorgeous. Perfect rainbow sparkle would be great for an accent now or a fall bling now. It's like a little disco on the nails. But I hope you found that application video helpful on how to apply these strand glitters to a nail. Super, super quick and easy. And check out the description box below for all the links on where you can find this beautiful glitter from Charlie's Now Art. And of course my discount code BNM15, which you can use on their website to save some pennies. And as always, thanks for watching. Stay safe and until next time, bye.